Hey everyone, this is Trix LA and I am in Eyes on You Photography's bathroom. Today we're gonna have a girls fashion night and we're now we're getting ready to eat. Um she's gonna get ready and then I'm gonna introduce you guys. Let's get this day started. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We are getting ready. Oh, hey, Maps LA. Eyes on you, photography. Can we come in? Getting ready. Oh. We'll give you guys a little video of everything later. This is Maddie Cakes. Oh, she's walking away now. So we're hanging out now, now that we ate. <laughs> We're not hungry anymore. So this is Eyes on You Photography, Crystal Lopez. And this is uh, Welcoming to the Channel. She's amazing. So the way that we met uh, was through mutual friends. So shout out to La Pesita. So thank you for inviting, um, inviting me to your channel. I really do appreciate the shout out. Um, so Eyes on You Photography basically started as a hobby. So what, what inspired Eyes on You Photography? Can you tell us a little bit of what inspirations you had? Who were your heroes? Anything? Yeah, my inspiration basically comes from fashion. Uh, runway, supermodels, growing up with music videos working in the fashion industry and uh, being around a mother who we love beautiful things. I love beautiful things myself and that's the vanity part of it. But I love shopping and I love arrows and I thought, well, why, why, why can I shoot uh, young girls where I can teach them confidence and we can create any type of arrow with fashion. I grew up around a lot of fashion. Um, I had a, a mother who's dressed really nice. She's you know, considered a fashionista. Uh, hung out with a lot of uh, people in the LGBTQ who also were you know, fashionista at it. What well, year did you start? Like, how long have you been doing this for? For a well, while, if you kind of rewind going back, um, the fashion started when I, uh, me growing up, being around it, uh, I was obsessed with music videos uh, and runway, and I worked for BCBG, which is a French designer, and uh, put it invested six years there and that was like my early 20s I also had my own uh, event name called fad which means fashion art and dance and it was fashion related so every event I would make sure that I created a fashion show and I had teamed up with one of my friend Maria who used to be a director uh, for uh, La Perla laundry which is a really really high-end laundry line in Beverly Hills. Tons of talent I have. Uh, performers and, you know, girls that could be models. So I feel like I'm in that moment where I would love to have a cultural center and a bunch of videographers. We model call-outs. So now, like, we're here to teach. We're in this world to exist to show our skills and to teach others what yes. we know and also learn from others. So, What are the latest projects or recent things that you have been working on? Well, I haven't been consistent the way I, I wanted to. I've been trying to recruit amateur models. I work in a community right now. I'm a organizer as well and I run two nonprofits and uh, try to find models within my own community, you know that you know and that's where I think I'm leaning towards uh, my future is just creating a community uh, in the arts because I'm already in a community but it's outdoors and it's hot and I just having like a, more of a cultural center studio I used to have a studio I want to bring the studio again yeah and I'm just look, trying to find out where do I want a studio yeah where do we do start it at home, make it more intimate and create like a vibe here and yeah 
and I feel like photography is starting to fade off on, on cameras because of these phones are so good and all the apps are there and it's just like it's getting tougher to be a, like a photographer yeah but it's not, but it's not tough to find and it's amazing. it's not impossible yeah every, the possibilities are endless when you find a, a community that has the same mindful mind as yourself you know? so that's why I'm and you're just seeing beauty everywhere so it's just so always it's, growing like I'm surrounded by beauty and I want to take take initiative to create something while I'm there with all these amazing talents, you know what I mean? So that's where I'm at.